hi uh, let's see how can you use the produce image editor to uh, manipulate different creatives let me first open a single image i will show you how can you make changes to it first thing is to uh, replace images within this so the way this uh, creative is structured is this is a canvas with different elements kept in here in case you want to replace an image let's say i want to replace this particular image I can just uh, go to the media tab and I can just pick any image and I can drop it on top of it. Uh, now if you notice, once I have dropped it, the image is placed as is. I can move this image by double clicking on it the way I did right now. Uh, the thing to consider here is that it is possible the image might not move uh, too much to your liking. That would be because of the bounds of the image and of the shape. Uh, this is one way of uh, doing it. Other way is, let me just uh, pick up some other example. I'll just go here. I will show you how can you uh, change images or you can add it within different shapes. Going back to the media tab, I can select this image. I can also click on the different image to replace. Um, another way is I'll go to the elements bit. Now let's say instead of the square, I want to put it inside a different shape. I will pick up uh, this and I will drop it on top of the image. Once I drop it, I, the image actually took this shape which was only the smaller. I'll drop it. I will pick up a shape like this and I will drop it on top of it. In this case, as you notice, the image has taken the shape. I can always double click on the image and I can uh, choose to move it a little bit. Another uh, thing which I would want to show you here is uh, replacing images within a smaller type of uh, shape. For example, if this is how the image looks like, I can always double click on the image and move it to the focus area. Um, another thing to look at is something like this. Now if you notice the image is of a larger size which is from this bounds and the shape here is only this. In this case I might want to reduce the image size a bit so that it uh, fits perfectly. Now as you notice the image will not reduce uh, like the size of the image won't become lesser than the size of the shape which is why after at this point I can only put it here. Another thing which we uh, keep on uh, getting requests from users is how to set up backgrounds for uh, these different type of creatives. Now in our case if you want to set up a background you will need to select a shape make it uh, full size and then something like this I will just make it uh, full screen like this after that I can just give it a different color whatever color I like let's say this is the color I can then click on the position I can gradually keep on moving it down to showcase whatever elements I want to do let's say this is how it is this is how you can uh, set a background this was uh, all about images shapes changing them uh, look at how can you edit videos in this case uh, things are a bit more complicated because um, it is also a factor of what like uh, which point of time do you want the video to be played so you can drag drop the focus area the way i'm doing here apart from that you can also click on the trim video option wherein you can select the exact point of time in which you want the video to start playing within that so if i just drag it like this you will see that the video keeps on coming out this is uh, second replacing videos again works the way uh, like exactly the way like images i can just go to the media tab go to videos and i can go and replace them that's it uh, i hope uh, this is helpful please let us know if you have any questions thank you